Hello everyone and welcome to you all to my channel and today in this video I will teach you how you can reserve a visit in the immigration office online at home and how you can check the expiry date of your alien card or your visa with ease at home so for that you have to go to high korea website and the high korea website look like this it's all in korean so if you want to change it into english and make it friendly for you you can just go to the top right corner of the screen and there is an english button so you can just click on there and then the website is converted into english at first i will teach you how you can check the expiry date of your alien card so for that you have to go to expiry date check and when you click that you have to enter certain detail of your accurately so here you have to enter your passport number your nationality from the list of the country you can choose your country if it's not there itself in the first list so you can click on the others and then select a country and after you make selection of your country you can also choose your exact date of birth that is in your passport and after that after you enter your detail click on the confirm button and then this kind of a screen will appear with your expiry date and your visa status and everything and if you have any confusion or problem regarding any issue in immigration related issues you can always call 1345 which is a immigration contact number and here you can use any language that is convenient to you based on the selections now i will teach you how you can reserve a visit for the immigration from home so for that you can see a reserve a visit option after you click that this kind of screen will appear and when this screen will appear you can just scroll it down little bit down and if you already have an id in this website that is high korea then you can log in as a member and if you don't have an id you can log in as a non-member so when you scroll this page little down little down there are certain notices and also there are two options reserve visit application member and non-member so if you don't have an id in this website you can reserve a visit as a non-member you just click there to reserve a visit as non-member and after that this kind of screen will appear and when this screen will appear you just go to identification verification using passport number and when you click on that another screen should appear there and this kind of screen will obviously appear and here you have to put your details like the previous one there's the passport number your nationality you can select from the list of the country and also your date of birth exactly as mentioned on your passport and after that you can click on to confirm and when you click on confirm you get this kind of a screen again so here you have to fill the nearest immigration office convenient to you and then you can also choose different options here so for that you should choose your purpose of visit maybe it's a foreign resident registration or issue of alien card or visa extension or change of visa status or granting a visa or permission for other activities or any other thing like work permit or also re-entry permit so you can choose from this list which is needed for you you should also enter your phone number here the idea of putting phone number is that you will get a confirmation on your phone number after the reservation so it will be easy for you and also here you can choose the date for your registration like the required date that you want to book for you which is convenient for you you can choose from the list of this and if there is not available date you can always call 1345 and confirm and here yeah, you can also mention purpose of visit and then, so after you click apply you are done with the reservation process you will get your call number that will be used in the immigration office in your sms and also in the confirmation page you can save that confirmation page as a pdf and use it later when visiting the immigration office in your desired time desired date thank you so much everyone for watching i hope this video was useful to you all
let me know in the comment section if this was useful to you and see you soon again in the next video have a great day stay productive stay blessed thank you